freezing. I'll just wait for it to heat up. A few moments later. Ugh, someone used all the hot water again. How am I supposed to wash my hair? Hey guys, it's Julia, and today I am doing a greasy hair life hacks hairstyles video because I have not done a hair video in so long, and lately I've been letting my hair get like second day, third day, kind of just washing my hair less just because it's super healthy and good for your hair. And I thought I'd show you some fun trendy hairstyles that I use a lot when my hair is gross and greasy and dirty and just bleh. But these hairstyles still make my hair look good. Also, if you're not already subscribed to my channel, make sure you hit subscribe. And if we get this video to 15,000 likes, that would be amazing. So let's go ahead and get on with the hairstyles. To start, you're going to want to have really gross, oily hair for this. It works much better, trust me. I know what you're probably thinking, Julia, why? But we're gonna make magic out of this mess. The first trendy hairstyle we're gonna start with are the double French braid buns. So I'm going to start by parting my hair in the middle all the way down and just brushing it. Now we're going to do some French braids and if you guys don't know how to do a French braid, there are so many tutorials on YouTube that you can just look up but we're going to be French braiding each side of the hair all the way down and doing the same thing to the other side. So once you got yourself some nice French braids, you could either stop here and work this look or you can take some bobby pins and twist them into little space buns. Then once I had them all twisted, I just bobby pin them in place so they would stay and do the same thing to the other side and ta-da! That's all you gotta do for this hairstyle. Now for the French braid ponytail, which makes your ponytail a little less boring. So we're going to start with some dirty hair, of course. Just brush it to the center of your head, kind of, I don't know, part it so that you have like a big chunk in the center. And then we're going to clip that chunk. And then we're going to take a piece from each side and then tie it into a half up, half down ponytail to start. Now I'm going to take the middle piece and just French braid it down. Again, if you don't know how to French braid, there are tons of tutorials on YouTube that could teach you. And once you French braided it, we're going to put it in a ponytail. And tie a piece of hair around the ponytail to make it look a little fancier. And then bobby pin that up. And there you go, a French braid ponytail. A little bit different than a normal ponytail. Now we're gonna do this trendy hairstyle called the wet look, and this works better with shorter hair, but I have long hair and I made it work. So we're gonna need some hairspray, gel, and a hairbrush. Wow, there's so many little hairs in here. Does this happen to you guys too? Ew. This hairstyle is literally so easy. All you gotta do is brush back your dirty hair and clip it back just to help. Then hairspray like a ton, like so much hairspray that you're like, whoa, my hair is hard. And yeah, I just hairsprayed in my eye. Very painful. So after we smoothed it all down, we're just going to take out the clip and apply some gel to really hold it in place. And there you go, that's off of this hairstyle. Now for the last hairstyle, which is really easy to and super simple, but I do this all the time so I thought I would show you guys anyway. So basically it's just a sleek ponytail, so I'm going to brush all my hair back into a high ponytail, almost at like the crown of my head I think, and just wrap a piece of hair around it to cover up the ponytail holder, and bob pin that up so it gives it like more of a up feel. I don't know, it like makes it more perky. And then I'm gonna hairspray it so all of the little baby hairs are stuck to my head and that's all you gotta do. So easy and so cute. Okay, so that's all for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up, a comment down below, and subscribe for more of my videos. And if you missed my previous video, you can click here on the screen to watch it or the link in the description of all my social media. So I'll either see you in that video or my next video. I'll talk to you guys later. Hi! Bye!